هلو مرحبا I'm Yazid and welcome to Arajev Point Plant. Up there, one of the mighty turbines. Wow. There are 41 here and some of them are still under construction. Today, I'm going to give you a special behind the scenes tour of Jordan's newest wind plant. Below you, the team are erecting a steel cage, laying the foundations of turbine 15. Once they've built the cage, they'll begin pouring the concrete. This side stretches for 12 kilometers. So Samir, you're one of the engineers on the site. Could you tell us how complicated it is to build a wind turbine? Now once the concrete foundation is poured and the soil is backfilled to a level similar to this, we bring in a tower crane like this one weighs about 650 tons. The tower crane erects the tower that makes up the tower of the turbine. Comes in three sections for our model. On top of that comes the nacelle, which is to your right. Hold on a second, please. Guys, please look behind you. Yeah, go on. Once the nacelle is on top, the hub is installed. And then to the hub, the three blades are connected. The blades are made of fiberglass and the majority of research and development that goes into making turbines goes into the blades. How about the cost and the time? Well, time for erection is about two weeks, but it also depends on the weather, so it might be longer. And the cost is a million plus per wow. turbine. For the whole thing? Yes. Ironically, there can't be too much wind when assembling a turbine. A clear, still day is perfect, which we don't get very often. Hey, these turbines are very impressive and they're way bigger than me. I'm around 190, so if we do some little math, that'd be probably 40 times my size. Down the valley is the Rajiv town. And beyond that is the ancient city of Petra. When finished, this plant will generate around 270 gigawatt hours per year. That's enough energy to power 53,000 Jordanian homes. Six years ago, we had no wind plants, no solar plants. Now, we're turning green. Jordan is in a renewables revolution. <laughs> 